Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing kind of an assortment of cleaning. I've got some floors to clean and mop, and then I've got a decluttering I wanna do underneath my sink in the bathroom. I have so much stuff underneath the sink, it's just like keeps piling up. So I'm finally decluttering that. I got a couple organization things to go under there to make it easier to see. So, and then I've got some dishes to put away, some laundry to fold. I'm gonna dust our cabinets and our walls and one of the vents in our kitchen. So just a lot of stuff. So come along with me and clean with me. It was a Thursday night when I first saw you. Those green eyes caught me, yeah, it was crazy It was a Friday night when I first kissed you It struck me like lightning You broke my chains and released me And days turned into nights on the couch in your apartment No, I am not the same Everything has changed Every day Now that the dishes are finally done and put away and the dirty dishes are stacked in the dishwasher, I am using my Swiffer duster to dust the cabinets and the walls and the top of the door frames, basically everything up high that I really can't reach that you just don't really look at. I mean, I personally don't look at it because I'm so short. I'm sure my husband sees more than I do, but there was so much dust up by the lights on top of the ceiling and the vents and the top of the cabinet. So I finally broke out the duster and took the time to dust all of it. Maybe stare too much cause you don't understand. You got me a bit selfish when you wake too humble might be overzealous getting you in trouble cause i'm a little bit steady even a little bit mad might be a disaster or just the best you've ever had Now 
Now that the dusting is done, I've got a couple loads of laundry that I need to go through that have just kind of been sitting here forever. That's just the life of laundry, I think. So I'm gonna fold the laundry really quick before I get into decluttering underneath my bathroom sink. Something better, wait a second. I wanna stay up late with my heart in We are finally done with the laundry and everything is put away. So I'm going to clean off the cabinets right here uh, with all of the dirt and dust and toothpaste splatter and hairspray and all that good stuff. And then I'm going to declutter underneath the sink. This is all the stuff I just pulled out from underneath my sink. Like it's kind of organized because I've got little bins and stuff for everything, but <laughs> I've got a lot of stuff. I've got I multiple bags. I I've got pads under here from postpartum still that were never opened. This is our travel bag. This is the one we take whenever we travel and go on vacation and stuff. So it's got like all the travel stuff in it. But then these are like just extra bags, extra stuff. I don't even have a bathtub in this bathroom. Though I kind of wish I did so I could use these. I could always put that in the kids bath though in case I ever want to take a bath. Stuff I've just never opened that I got for Christmas. What else is down here? Some yummy smelling bar soap, some lashes that I don't wear. <laughs> I think I've worn them once for like my sister's wedding and my wedding, but that was about it. A tub full of nail polish, some lotion for curling my hair, which I don't use. This is like my travel jewelry box which I actually okay, really do Mom. like, okay. so I'll keep this. I just need to figure out where to keep this, if I can open it. Okay, Mom. I forgot I had this. <laughs> Face stuff, I've still got <laughs> like nursing pad things. What's this? Oh, a Freedom Mom 
sits bath thing that I never used. So just lots of stuff that needs to be decluttered. Probably don't need my stretch mark cream anymore. I mean, maybe I can keep it for if we have another one. How long does this stuff last though? Probably not that long. Don't know. Whitening strips, foot masks, lip masks, more foot masks, ovulation kit, face wipes, a spa headband, face mask. So, and then this is like the stuff I generally use every day. Well, not like every day, but whenever I do my makeup. In this little bath, in this little spinner. And I've decluttered this recently, so I probably won't be going through any of that. that little travel bag I was telling you guys about. This is what I 
take with us whenever we go on vacations. So I'm gonna go through this really quick and declutter it, organize it, refill some of the items in here like the toothpicks and the ear swabs and all of that good stuff. Like I'm hypnotized, can't get out of here You don't know me, I just need my time Yeah But they say and that is the final product. I've got my makeup in the little container here that spins and then I've got all my hair products in this other turntable that spins and got rid of a ton of stuff, donated a ton of stuff and made so much more room in here. It is so much more organized. Okay, so here's some stuff we're getting rid of. All this will probably be garbage because I've already used it or it's almost empty. This doesn't even work on my daughter's hair anymore or like at all. I bought it because her favorite color is purple, but she's got such dark hair and it's such a light purple spray. I'll probably donate that. And then just an old toothbrush, a basically empty toothpaste. Probably donate all of that stuff over there. Garbage. Donate those two bags. Figure out somewhere to put that. Maybe in like a, my postpartum box that I have from previous pregnancies. But yeah, it's much cleaner down there. Now we are going to pick up all of this stuff on the floor. So I'm moving all of the bar stools and the step ladder and the garbage can and all that stuff so that I can vacuum and then mop. I just got the new O Cedar mop and I'm gonna, this is the first time I'm trying it out. Um, to be honest, at the very end, you'll notice I wasn't a huge fan of it. I feel like I got a like a full body workout in as I was mopping. And I also feel like my steam mop that I normally use picked up way more dirt off of the floor than the O Cedar mop did when I dumped the water out from the O Cedar mop. I just wasn't super impressed. So the floors look clean. I mean, they looked good. It, it did its job. I just, I feel like my steam mop does a better job. <laughs> What did you expect now? That you feel better? I tell no simple lies. What didn't cut you down? What do you regret now? Thinking you were clever. Tell those little lies. La la, baby, won't you la la? Singing out loud to the 
possible that I didn't put enough water in it. Like maybe I spun it too much and I just didn't have enough water on the mop head itself. Because as I'm playing this back, like I felt like I did when I was mopping it, I could see the watermarks. But as I'm playing it back, I can't really see the watermarks on the camera. So it's possible that it's the camera or maybe I just didn't use enough water. I don't know, but I wasn't a huge fan. Is what we have of what is left of us Left of us You don't think things through No, I know you Only photographs Is what we have So that is everything I've got for you guys today. I want to thank you so much for taking the time to watch all the way to the end if you did. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already as it really does help out and I will see you in the next video. Bye. I kind of